Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Captendo and as you can see, uh, my <laughs> my studio here in the background is being built. So uh, that's currently under construction. <laughs> so for today's video, uh, you already saw the thumbnail. We are going to be doing a tier list and this tier list is going to be on the electric mice, the electric rats, the electric rodents of Pokemon. And what we're going to be doing is we're just going to be going over their design with some uh, personal bias. <laughs> it's usually how these go. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and bring this up here. All right. Uh, should I make this a little bigger? I'll make it a little bigger for you guys. Boom. There we go. First up on this list, we have, let me make sure what's the, what's the top layer. We're going to go by top layer. So these are kind of randomized, but we got all the, uh, the Pokemon here. Uh, I got Mimikyu. I know he's not like an electric mouse, but I just, I thought it'd be fun. So <laughs> you know what I'm going to do? Hold on. Let me change the settings so you guys can see, you guys can see exactly what I see now. There we go. So top layer, we got Pikachu again, solid design. I still think that there are Pokemon on this list that are higher than Pikachu. So overall solid design, I'm going to go ahead and put him at a B tier just for design, possibly an A tier, but you know, we'll, we'll readjust it as we, cause, cause again, I'm, I'm using him as like the base, the standard, I guess. I don't know, but, uh, you know, you know what? Yeah. Let's leave him at B tier. All right. So he goes right there for B tier. Next up we have Togedomaru. So already weird name but design wise i would say that this thing is cuter than pikachu this is what i meant it's like biased <laughs> biased thing it's kind of changes i changed the rules here <laughs> but um i am just gonna go ahead and say we're gonna put him cuteness wise you know what let's just do cute we're gonna go cute <laughs> so next up we have Alolan Raichu. Now I have some things to say about this one. Alolan Raichu, the design is okay, but I would have to say, I, I guess just looking at it, just standard Alolan Raichu. I don't know what the shiny one looks like. I don't, I think I've seen it before, but I can't remember. But anyways, the Alolan Raichu, I'm just going to go ahead and say, I'm either going to put it at a B tier or maybe a in between, eh. You know what? I'm going to put it at C tier. There are things I like about it, but I think mainly it's just the color palette. And that's exactly what I want to talk about to you guys right now. <laughs> there is a picture that someone made and I have the image and I'll throw it up on screen here. They made a Lolan Raichu with the standard Raichu color palette. And it looks so much better guys, guys, like it, <laughs> this thing looks so much better. Like if this was the Raichu, this thing, I would honestly put uh this this standard raichu palette alolan raichu i would probably put this at s tier <laughs> like i mean that that's a drastic change like it looks so good <laughs> so i don't know S standard alolan raichu c tier alolan raichu with the default raichu color palette s tier all right that, that's what that's what we'll do i could have added that image here but i you know what i'm just gonna go ahead and add it hold on give me a second and put him here in st <laughs> he kind of blocks up a lot of stuff <laughs> uh ooh, emolga that's what it's called emolga honestly emolga cuter than pikachu I, actually now i'm looking at this picture cuteness wise it, it's it's a lot cuter than Togedomaru. Togedomaru is just like a round ball, which I think is part of what, you know, makes it cute. But Emolga, just design-wise, I think it's pretty cute. I, I didn't want to do halvesies. We'll put it in between A and S tier. Eh. You know what? We'll put them S tier for now. <laughs> I didn't want to do halvesies. <laughs> All right. Next up, we have Pachirisu. So Pachirisu. Ooh, that's the wrong thing. <laughs> Pachirisu. Honestly, I'm going to put Pachirisu at a C tier. I'm not a big fan of Pachirisu. I think Pikachu is definitely cuter than Pachirisu. So Pachirisu just sits here and no, I, I, I could see, I could see why people would like Pachirisu. Like I could see what people would like about it. You know, it's like a squirrel, I guess, but I don't know. We're going design. Ooh. 
you know what for for its own things we'll just put it here in b tier with pikachu right and pikachu we might move up pikachu i guess it's dependent on what angle you look at pikachu because there are some pictures where pikachu is cute uh, definitely fan art but we're not going to count fan art for this well <laughs> i say when i got <laughs> that alolan raichu up at s rank <laughs> You know, that doesn't matter. We're not, <laughs> I told you this is going to be biased. So, you know what? Yeah, we'll keep them at B tier. All right, next up is Minun. So, Minun, or Minun, I call it Minun because it's like plus and minus. So, Plusle and Minun, they, they have their own things that kind of separate them from each other, but they're also still very similar in design. I'm going to put them both in A tier, right? Cuteness, they're both going up in A tier. Next up, we have... Ooh, dead, jeez, oh, <laughs> dead Dene. <laughs> this thing absolutely 100% cuter than, look at this thing. <laughs> so, it's a, this thing is automatic S tier, right? This thing is automatic S tier. <laughs> but yeah, absolutely much cuter than Pikachu. If they made this the new mascot for Pokemon, which I, I would say would be pretty difficult, because, you know, Pikachu's been the mascot for over 20 years, so... Yeah, I don't know, but I, if they made this new mascot, I would not complain. <laughs> Next up, we have... Oh, what was this thing called? Oh, what was this? Pe... 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 Pecoro... Pe... Perico... Pe... Peca... Peca... Shum what was this thing called? <laughs> More... More Peko, more, it's either more Peko or more Pico. I, I like, I like more Pico. That sounds better to me. I like more Pico, so that's what I'm gonna call it. More Pico. So this thing, this thing is actually pretty cute. And, and when I look at it, it reminds me of, does that one girl have it? The one that's like, I guess like the new favorite, I guess. The one that the Team Yell people chase, which is weird because they're also adults. <laughs> they're following around this little girl. I don't know, that's weird. Actually, you know what? I could see this thing being an S tier. I'm gonna put it S tier. So, Pichu. Pichu is adorable. It's its own like little kind of baby Pokemon. Is it better than Pikachu? I couldn't find a better Pikachu picture, actually. I don't know. I, and I was just trying to find standard. I was trying to find like non-fan art. And a lot of the pictures, they either weren't PNGs, which is why I didn't use them. I was looking for PNGs to use for this, so I didn't have to make my own. But uh, out of PNGs, that was the best Pikachu I could find. Pichu itself, I would say it's cuter than Pikachu. We'll put Pichu at A tier. Wow, we got a lot of good ones today. <laughs> Not that a little bit of Raichu, though. <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> Next, we have Mimikyu. So, Mimikyu. I know, I know, I know, like I said, I know it's not an electric mouse, but it's dressed up like Pikachu, and I thought it'd just be fun. <laughs> so, I would go ahead and say this design, like, like the whole design, I guess, uh, I'm gonna go put it at A tier. There are a lot of people who like Mimikyu. I can see why. Part of it is just like how it's trying to make a costume to make itself look more approachable and stuff. It, it's... I don't know. It's got a lot of factors going its way. I'm going to put... I forgot what his name was. <laughs> I, I just said it. <laughs> ah, I can't think about it. <laughs> what was it called? <laughs> Mimikyu. Wow. <laughs> Next up, we have more Pico which is what I'm calling it, but we have the hangry version. I figured if we're doing Raichu and we're doing Alolan Raichu, it's only fair that we do both versions of Morpeko. So we got the one at S tier, then we got this purple one. Um, it's the same design, but I think because of the color scheme, like adding the purple and stuff, maybe if it was like a more pastel purple, you know, even if it looked angry, it would still look cute, I guess. But... Uh, we'll go ahead and put it at, hmm, well, this is a tough one. I, I don't know if I want to put it at B tier or A tier, huh? I'm just going to put it at B tier, right? There we go. It's done. <laughs> and now, last but not least, we have ourselves Raichu. Now, Raichu, 
I think Raichu has a better design, a much more cuter, more like big and kind of plump design than Pikachu. So I think Raichu goes up to A tier, possibly S tier. I'm looking at the rest I put in A tier. I think Raichu's cuter than the other ones in A tier. I'm going to put Raichu in S tier, right? And I'm not like a big Raichu fan, but I still think it's cuter than Pikachu. It, wow. <laughs> Both the pre-evolution and the, the actual evolution of Pikachu are better. <laughs> so again, everyone, that's my tier list. Again, this is just my opinion. You know, you might place them somewhere else and let me know where you place them as well. You know, let me know the reasons why as well. Maybe that'll change my perspective on some of them. But for now, this is my tier list. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will try to get my studio, uh, you know, finished <laughs> in the future so uh other than that thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys next time bye everyone